For seven minutes, one woman captured this footage. Okay, so can you put your hand off me? The Dinah Police Department stresses there's a lot that led up to this encounter that was not recorded in this video. I know, I'm saying maybe you could just suggest that he go to it up the other side and help him. But this police dash cam video obtained by 5 Eyewitness News is shedding new light into the incident. It picks up as police escort Larney Thomas to the squad car. So what am I going to jail for? I have no idea. I just but you here. know I'm going to jail though. No, know you've anything. been here. What's that? You heard me. Mr. Thomas stresses he was not blocking traffic. I'm not on the street where cars can hit me. Okay. Yes. So, you, so you're between, on the road. Between the curb and the white line. I'm inside of it. Yeah. And, but Just like a construction worker. Yeah. The dash cam footage also recorded multiple witnesses telling police what they think happened. I didn't think he was doing anything wrong. This woman says even though Mr. Thomas used profanities in the video, he was told by police, quote, you can't talk like that in this neighborhood. I perceive that he was really afraid. And when somebody, you don't treat people that way. Two other witnesses tell police the officer was justified in stopping Mr. Thomas. He was in traffic. So he was walking down the middle of the street. Cars were honking at him. He had his headphones on. I didn't see anything else that he did at all. The city of Edina eventually took the cuffs off Mr. Thomas, gave him a ride to Southdale Center, and dropped the citation against him. But what put him in the back seat of this squad car is still generating plenty of questions and outrage.